did not have a very good night sleeping. No, it was uh, kind of disconcerting to have that happen. And at that point, uh, they were, you know, like I say, very close to the vest on uh, information. So I didn't know if there was anyone in the vehicle at that point. I uh, didn't hear any ambulances last night. So I was kind of hoping that it was just, you know, uh, shots against a vehicle versus a person. Uh, but then found out differently this morning. Anything like this ever happened in your neighborhood? Anything oh, no. Like this? Any issues with people stopping in the neighborhood? To... No, but being retired and jogging up and down the street uh, f a few days every week, uh, I, I kind of know where vehicles are, where vehicles aren't, and the kind, and um, this one was clearly out of place. I did look at online for uh, information about, you know, what they were uh, putting in the news so far, and they had the phone number to call for further information if you had a tip. So I did call them and got a hold of a detective and uh, sent the uh, audio and video to them. The video is, of course, dark in there because I, I don't have the, the night setting, but I do have a timestamp. So I know exactly when it happened. It was exactly 10.30 last night. I, I, I can pick that up from the video. What are your neighbors saying today? What's what's been the reaction as you talk to people? Um, equal shock, but hoping that it's a random event and uh, not something we have to deal with anytime again.